hello students welcome to my channel uh, in this video we are going to discuss example 2.2 uh, from chapter number 2 the working fluid from the book applied thermodynamics by td stop and mcconkey the statement of example is calculate the dryness fraction specific volume and the specific internal energy of steam at 7 bar and specific enthalpy is 2600 kilojoule per kilogram <coughs> so first of all uh, we will write the given data uh, we have given the pressure 7 bar and uh, enthalpy specific enthalpy is 2600 kilojoule per kilogram So, at 7 bar, we have, if we check the steam table of uh, wet vapors or saturated vapor, so at 7 bar, we have Hg value, which is specific enthalpy at saturated vapor line, and its value is 2764 kilojoule per kilogram. HF is 697 kilojoule per kilogram. Specific volume at saturated vapor line is 0 0.2728 cubic meter per kilogram. Specific entry energy at saturated line is liquid saturated liquid line is 696 kilojoule per kilogram. And similarly, the value of specific internal energy at saturated vapor line is 2573 kilojoule per kilogram. So if we compare the value of H and Hg, so in this case H is less than Hg because H has value which is 2600 kilojoule per kilogram which is less than 2764 kilojoule per kilogram so it means that the value of hg is greater than the value of h so it says that the steam is in the wet region or the steam is situ saturated steam so now using the equation h is equal to hf plus x hfg this is the equation of specific enthalpy for uh, saturated steam or wet steam so from this uh, equation suppose this is equation a so putting the known values at 7 bar uh, if we put these values specific enthalpy value, values in this uh, expression so uh, this a equation will become 2600 is equal to h is 2600 HF is 697 plus X 2067. Uh, 2067 is the value of HFG which is HG minus HF. HG is 2764 and HF is 697. If we take the difference of these two specific uh, enthalpies, so we get 2067. So simplifying this, we get the value of dryness fraction. Uh, in this uh, example, we are required to find three things. One is uh, dryness fraction and second is we have to find the specific volume and third we have to find the specific internal energy. So dryness fraction is if we simplify this we get 0 0.921. So this is the required value of dryness fraction. Similarly, to find the specific volume of the wet steam, for that again using the expression which has been used in example 2.1, small v is equal to x vg. x is 0 0.921 and vg is 0 0.2728 cubic meter per kilogram from the steam table. So if we multiply these two we get 0 0.2515 cubic meter per kilogram. So this is the required value of specific volume. Now to find the value of specific internal energy for that we use this expression 
uh, small u is equal to 1 minus x into uf plus x ug uh, 1 minus x x is 0 0.921 uh, uf is 696 according to the uh, value given in the steam table similarly ug is 2573 so x is 0.921 multiplied by 2573 so if we simplify this we get 2420 kilojoule per kilogram so these are the required values of uh, dryness fraction uh, specific volume and specific internal energy so this is the overall discussion of example 2.2 in next video we will discuss uh, example 2.3 and 2.4 Thanks. Thanks for watching. Please like and comment on my videos. Also subscribe my channel to get new videos.